welcome back to GameSpot Presents The Mix right here at GDC 2015. Alexei Abramenko, thank you very much for coming all the way from Russia to show us uh, your video game today. Uh, really, really appreciate it. This is the last one we're showing today, uh, but it's uh, also one of the best looking games. Uh, we have, this is number nine we've had today, uh, Jetpack Squad. Uh, tell us all about it, tell us about your game. Well, it's a uh, shoot em up, uh, and basically it's a shoot em up with a focus on uh, speed, interactivity, mm. and the explosions. Yeah, and uh, this game heavily uses physics, mm. and uh, like in most shmups, you're trying to avoid the stuff, but here the whole game is built on interaction, so basically you have to uh, like bump into the stuff, mm. grab it, throw it around, and yeah, the, the whole gameplay is going to be based on that. Excellent. Uh, let's hop right in. Um, uh, you've got okay. the game loading up already. Uh, the best way to show it is by all means to, to hop in and play. Yeah, there is no pause yet, so... <laughs> Don't worry, it's GDC. No. We're all used to... Um, yeah, appreciate so you guys showing us early versions of all these. Yeah, the, all the smart basics, you can like jump, dash around and shoot enemies. The animation is absolutely gorgeous. It's so smooth. Uh, how big is the team that's working on this? Uh, there are two of us. Two of you? Yeah. And you guys are the folks behind uh, Intrusion, right? Intrusion 2 came out in, was that 2012 or something? Uh, yes, yeah, somewhere around that time. I mean, I worked alone on Intrusion, mm. on Intrusion 2. And then on this game, we're working together. This is, <laughs> just saying this is not the easiest game to play and yeah, <laughs> talk like with at the same time. There's so much going on. I'm oh, doing, wow. I'm doing pretty bad. <laughs> so, yeah, you've got the sword. You can like cut enemies and reflect the bullets, so it, it gets very useful when you get like a barrage of bullets. Yeah, because it's between you were not only did you like rebound that bullet, but you also like picked up the projectile and threw it back yeah, as well. Yeah, it's the third third type of attack. You can wow. grab objects and throw them <laughs> around. And it's so smooth. Uh, do you have you do you do the art as well for this, or is that who your your second in command is is helping with? Yeah, Whoa. I think I died. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's yeah, this is like one of the more difficult games to uh, talk about and play mm -hmm. at the same time. Basically, oh. uh, the other guy's uh, name is Alex Nikonov. Hmm. He does the background art, the character art. And I'm doing the programming and animation and basically game design. Oh my god. Uh, so what is it like in terms of uh, progression then? Are you, is this a short game that you're expecting people to play over and over again, like speedrun style? Yeah, m most likely. Mm. It would be, it, we'll try to make it as replayable as possible. And as difficult as possible, <laughs> presumably as well. Uh, yeah, what is the difficult progression like? Uh, um, is this one of the more challenging levels? Is this one of the easier levels? Jesus uh, Christ, well, what is that octopus dude? <laughs> for now, uh, I'm trying to make it like the average gameplay. Mm. So before that, there'll be like introduction level <laughs> where you will learn all your abilities, like all the controls. Mm. For now, it's just like core gameplay. I like that eyeball still looking at you after he's after he's been defeated. Oh my god. Can you pick up those guys as well? Uh, no, they hold to the ground. I mean, oh this, yeah. I can pick this one. He doesn't <laughs> have like... <laughs> <laughs> the, so yeah, there seems to be a lot of variety in terms of the um, enemies uh, that you have in this game. We're only a team of two people. How long have you been working on this? Uh, for about a year and a half. And before that I was doing the engine. I was making the engine. Basically, I didn't know what project I will start next. So yeah. I was just working on general stuff. And what, was there something about working on the, the, the previous two games, that something specific you wanted to, to do with, with, uh, with Jetpack Squad that you didn't do in, in, the, in, the, in that series? Uh, you mean uh, what I didn't do in Intrusion? Yeah, like in terms of uh, like mm. development, was there something like a different type of game you wanted to make? Uh, yeah, uh, like one thing I wanted to do, Intrusion was mainly blue, green and orange. Mm. That was like three <laughs> colors it was using. <laughs> And here I'm trying to use as much as possible without it looking ugly. <laughs> yeah. Well, it looks absolutely, it looks fantastic, especially considering there's only uh, two, two people working on it. It's, the, the, it's the, the motion, actually, the animation, the smoothness of it is what's so striking about it. 
uh, because the, the graphics themselves are obviously, you can make them as good as you want, but just com combining it with everything else, with the, the effects as well, and the particles and whatnot. Uh, is there any sort of story happening in this game? Is there any like progression in terms of your abilities, or is it all very much the same at the start? Uh, yeah, we are planning to well, make like different characters, so you can uh, collect the characters uh, and choose them before before the level. So they'll have like special abilities mm. and the passive effects. Like some can have more uh, more speed or like more life force. Mm. Mm. Different weapons, perhaps. Yeah, like. different. Like we got <laughs> melee weapons, so could be very different weapons. I like just picking up stones and throwing them. Can you pick up that van as well? No, that's bit, too, bit too big. Bit too big. Yeah, fair enough. These ninja dudes. Uh, is there any co-op, any online sort of stuff, or is this very much a single-player, like speedrun uh, type of high score type of game? We'll probably think about uh, a local uh, co-op multiplayer. I mean. <laughs> I <laughs> I'm guessing you encourage players to interact with the various enemies as much as possible. Yeah. Because you're right, it's like a, it's a whole different type of, um, like most shmups, you're just basically destroying everything in your path and you stay away from them is almost the key. But you're like encouraging people to sort of get in there and f fuck about with these things. Destroy trees. Uh, no, I can't destroy trees. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I can cut the grass. <laughs> but... Uh, have you been over for a GDC before? It's a long way to fly over from Russia. Yeah, it's uh, around 20 hours <laughs> in the air. <laughs> I've been to, it's my third time on GDC. Oh, yeah? I mean, the children was on IGF. Mm. Like, oh, of course, yeah, yeah. Oh. Oh. And what's it like actually coming over here to, is the development, is there a development community in Russia that's sort of largely not known of? in North America, or do you find when you come to something like GDC that that's when you're like meeting people within your world again? Uh, well, yeah, there is a community, but like I live uh, in a smaller town, so mm. in my town there is like no community. Mm. So, I mean, there are uh, specialized conventions like developer conventions and game conventions in Moscow and St. Petersburg, I think. God, we almost near the end of this level, or yeah, we almost near the, near the end. Is there a big dirty boss at the end we have to fight? Well, there is, but it's not ready yet. I mean. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> we'll just bounce out before that happens. Uh, excellent. Uh, what platforms um, is this going to come out on, and do you have any sort of idea when about? Uh, well, it's made on Unity, so it's excellent. very multi-platform. I mean, uh, like right now we're planning for PC, Mac, and Linux. Mm. And potentially it could come up on consoles. Maybe talk to some people here this week at GDC, perhaps, about that. That seems to be something that comes up a lot with uh, indie developers we have in here. Is this the boss that isn't finished yet? Oh, man. Yeah, it is not finished. It's <laughs> I can show some patterns, but yeah, it probably will do something ugly. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Hey, let's, yeah, let's let the demo end when it ends. Let's, let's just see what happens. Jesus Christ. What's going on in this world that there are massive robotic... Is that some sort of scorpion pig? Scorpion <laughs> spider? Uh, have you watched My Neighbor Totoro? It's N no. By Miyazaki. Yeah, basically they had like a character <laughs> that was a cat with 12 legs. Okay, right. So that's just a cat with a, with a, with a nice tail, I guess. Is there people inside of it? Yeah. <laughs> All right. All right, I believe in you. I know this isn't even finished, so perhaps it's not actually possible to destroy this. What's, what, what, what have you named it? Uh, cat uh, boss. Cat boss, nice. Is that what it's written in in the code? Mm, yes. <laughs> cat boss level. <laughs> I mean, that's the name from Totoro. Oh, OK. Yeah, I guess they, 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 they don't season the sisters <laughs> for that. <laughs> not yet. Let's not see how. Let's, we'll, just get, we'll edit this part out, don't worry. Oh, excellent. How many different, uh, with this level then, how many levels are in the game of this sort of like average length? Like, uh, Well, of this length, uh, well, we're planning at least three chapters, basically. Oh, wow. And the length of each chapter would be uh, like slightly bigger than this level. Mm. Well, it's the minimum, basically, what we're planning for now. Yeah, 
I got to destroy the tail. You almost got it. <laughs> is that the... Is, well, that move, do you think all the characters have that move? The sort of... It's kind of required, the, the circular shoot uh, move because of the amount of enemies that are behind you all the time. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, that's it. Yeah, hairballs are awful. Is this one of the th three level bosses? Oh. Yeah, and basically that's <laughs> <laughs> that's the end of all patterns. It will continue doing that. Oh, really? Yeah. Forever? Yeah. And ever? It doesn't explode. <laughs> all right, okay. Let's cut it there then. Uh, I appreciate it uh, at least seeing um, some of the end boss. Uh, as, as somebody mm -hmm. who owns a cat as well. Much appreciated. Alexi, thank you so much for coming in. Uh, you. As you said, this is coming out on uh, PC, Mac, Linux, or maybe on consoles. Do you have any idea when about this will be out? We, next year or sometime this year? Or? Yeah, we hope next year, but we have no idea how much to take. Fingers crossed. you still got you still got some work to do. Thank you so much for coming in. Uh, enjoy the rest of your GDC. Again, absolute pleasure to have you here.